design um, of the Morgana um, was a collaboration between ourselves and Nauta Yachts in Milan. Reichel Pugh was responsible for the naval architecture and uh, Nauta for um, the total exterior and interior design. You know. And it was a relatively long process. We actually started off with a shorter boat um, and the boat got extended a couple of times to accommodate the, you know, the owner's vision um, as he really understood what he wanted and it eventually became 100 feet. You know? So it was a fairly lengthy process, which is um, fairly typical when you're designing a boat of this size. In the development, a number of different lines plans which we ran through CFD programs, you know, and VPP programs to maximize uh, the performance of the boat and also the sea keeping of the boat, which was very important to the client um, as he was going to do a lot of uh, blue water cruising. Uh, the boat features um, a fairly narrow beam water line, which when the boat's upright, you know, light air performance is excellent. And quite a bit of um, flare in the middle of the boat for you know heeled stability so that the boat when the boat is power reaching and running and upwind in a breeze it's got plenty of stability. We have incorporated a small amount of V in the forward sections of the hull. This reduces slamming and provides comfort in a seaway. The high aspect center line rudder is an efficient lifting surface contributing to upwind performance while also providing excellent helm control. The sloop rig uses a single centerline backstay for cruising, but can be switched to twin backstays for racing with a square top mainsail. Flying sails are tacked to the bowsprit to increase the projection of these sails and provide excellent off-wind performance. The Reichel Few team is very pleased to see the launch of Morgana. We'd like to thank the owner for the opportunity to participate in this amazing project.